So there's this place in Arizona called Roden Crater, and this guy named James Terrell had this idea in 1974 that he wanted to create this gigantic piece of art that also doubled as a naked eye observatory. And it began construction in 1970, 1979 and has been going ever since, and it still has a few years, uh, depending on the funding that they get. But hopefully this place opens up soon because it looks really, really, really cool. And I want to see it really bad. I think it's probably on my number one places I want to see in my life. So so the next thing is a video uh, from the 1970s of this guy named Sidney Cohen who tests LSD on his housewife. And she's this just normal, cute little housewife. And he gives her a little bit of LSD and a glass of water and they film her reaction and you know what happens so it's not like some crazy hippie beatnik person you know taking LSD under a bridge or something like they really wanted to see what this stuff did to your mind and it's a pretty amazing video um, I would take the time and watch it because it's it she can't even use words to describe what she's she's experiencing at the moment and it's a really cool video so just check it out does anyone else remember the show at, at all? Is it is it just me? Like, like honestly, is it just me? Do, am I the only one who remembers this being on TV? Uh, it's got the coolest intro ever to a cartoon. Uh, it's a really fun show. I remember it came out in like 92, 93. Um, I was really, I was pretty little when it came out, but I still remember the show. It was really good. Uh, it's finally coming out on DVD um, July 30th, I think. Yeah, check it out. Thank you for watching if you've made it this far into the video. Uh, this is the very first video that I've done. Um, it's just something that I've wanted to do for a long time. And thank you for watching. I would enjoy any sort of feedback. You can hit me up on Facebook or leave a comment. Uh, I want to make the show better. I want to keep trying. I'm going to release a video every Friday. And hopefully they just get better and better because I'm still learning the software ends. There's still a few kinks that I need to work out uh, as I need transition sound. Yeah, that's what I need. I need some transition sound because it's, it's non-existent and it's sort of awkward. But I thought I would just finish this video and get it done and put it out there and see what you guys think. Uh, yeah, so thanks again for watching and I will see you next Friday.